So all these questions are very, very important. Uh, let me tell you, whenever we are solving this thing, we can solve it using elimination, substitution, any method. But I would suggest elimination is the best method for this. Okay. So in first thing in elimination is we need to make the coefficient of one variable same. So if you remember, mm -hmm. I told you, if we have 2x in the first equation, 3x in the second equation, you can do just cross multiplication. Multiply yeah. the first yeah. full equation by 3, second equation by 2. Remember this thing? 2. Yes. So similarly, I would suggest in this question, just multiply the first equation by Q, second equation by P because of the cross multiplication. Okay. So let us multiply. What will happen to the first equation? First equation. EQS plus Q square Y is equal to P Y minus Q square. And the uh, second equation will become PQX minus P square Y equals to p square plus pq. pq. Okay. Now yeah. I will just simply change the signs. This will become negative. This will become positive. This will become negative. This will become negative. Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. pqy, pqx. Yeah. So this, this thing will be cancelled? Yes. Yeah. So this will cancel this thing. And PQ. PQX, PQX will cancel. Now, over here, just write down. If you're not able to solve mentally, just write down what is remaining. So Q square Y plus P square Y is remaining. Understood? Okay. Clear? Yes. And what is remaining over here? PQ, PQ. Minus, minus Q square minus P square minus PQ. Understood? Yes. Now, see over here, this thing is PQ and PQ will get cancelled. And over here, we will get uh, y common. Yes. So y common q square plus p square equals to and over here I will get minus common negative common q square plus p square. Now I'll shift this. Uh, other than y, everything. So remember over here, x and y are the variables. Other things like b, q, a, b, all are arbitrary constants. So they are not looking like constants, but they are constants. So minus q square plus p square upon q square plus p square. I can cancel them because they are fully in bracket and exactly same. So y equals to minus 1. Understood. Okay. This was. Mm -hmm. It takes time. So first and second equations are there. This is my first equation. This is my second equation. So I can substitute in first equation also. Substituting. This is third. Third. Three and one. Okay. So Px plus Q bracket minus one equals to P minus Q. Clear? Yeah. Yeah. Px minus Q equals to P minus Q. Px equals to P minus Q plus Q. Q, Q cancel. 
similar grounds you can solve rest of the questions second part third part all of them you can solve okay so first of all try them if you are not able to do i will uh, do them for you also 